One time. Yo. I'm trying to think who could I get my two cents to. There ain't really too much current going on. Just know that the Chris Collective is growing. And again, I appreciate everybody. I'm almost a 600. Uh, I heard a lot of stuff on locks at five, but I got a lot of more video hours I got to create because uh, right now y'all just fucking with me on the shorts. But don't worry, I got shit. I'm working on shit. But once we get that thousand, everything get unlocked, we good from there. The ads and all that. Oh yeah. I'm about to start doing live here probably in a week or so too. You know what I'm saying? I'm just getting a little studio, some little shit together. So uh, once we do, we're gonna get it cracking. But uh I guess this video, real quick, I'll speak about a couple of people that I inspire me. Like DJ Ghost, he out in Vegas. He's from LA. He's probably one of the first I've really watched and seen how he did shit. As far as his family, then he had his reactions, then he had his own personal vlog. I dug that, you know what I'm saying? But he still was careful, you know, make sure not to give location, things like that. Uh, Adam 22, no jumper. I mean, I gotta, I gotta admit, some of his shit is interesting. A lot of this new shit I don't really feel because I don't fuck with the music, but I did watch him coming up, and he had another style that I was like, okay, okay, if I go with that route, as far as to get a studio and all that, that's what I would do. You know, hoodie from the hood, most definitely, San Diego. You know, I commented on your page every now and then, but uh, just know I'm watching, I'm learning. You know, a lot of people is in this game, so I gotta basically learn from the bottom. You know, I don't really have nobody I can reach out to. You know, Grub ENT, I really I fucks with you. You know what I'm saying? You responded to a nigga. No one else has yet to respond. So, in that sense, you automatically get the utmost from me. And uh, shit, who else? Street TV, Alonzo, man, you was one of the first two. And the reason I watched you, even though I'm not affiliated with no gang, is just because I wanted to know how his take on things when he interviewed people in certain areas. You know, where was their mindsets? You know, the times when I wasn't in L.A. You know, I was able to watch that and be on it. You know, just be caught up, current events. Same thing with Skip Thompson. Excuse me, Skip Townsend, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, brother. With your second, with the second call. I really like watching that because he gives back. And he's in every hood, it don't matter. He don't discriminate. A million hits. I really respect you because you in the streets. You know what I'm saying? You go to a scene before the police and say, hey, check on your loved ones, check on your family. Real talk. Uh, another new one I like besides Compton Rick Rock, I like the hub and the dub. Mainly because Watts is my shit. But, uh, haven't been back in a while. So I really want to know what it is. I mean, I go back every few years, but a lot of people I know are dead and gone. And I'm not a gang affiliated, so don't ask me. Just know Watts is my shit. And, uh, who else? I may be forgetting a couple, but just know that these are the ones that inspire me to do what I got to do as a future inspiring content creator. So I said, fuck it, I'm going to do it how I want, when I want. And set my goals and plans in motion. Hopefully I'll meet them. And I'm doing whatever I got to do, whether it's one video a day or ten. That's the goal, monetization, freedom, true freedom, better life. So on that note, y'all be easy. I just want to send a shout out.